Are you ready for the arena? Ladies and gentlemen, after a seemingly endless wait, the day we've all been waiting for is finally here. Welcome to the Lacour Armory Contest. We've got one of the best lineups in tournament history this year, and I can hardly wait to see what kind of action we'll see on the arena floor. Make sure you keep your eyes on the field, folks. You won't want to miss a second. Kicking off the first round, we have Amon Rao fighting against Claude C. Kenny. Who will emerge victorious? It's all going to go down right now. We can handle this. Air Slash! Ha -ha! Well, I'd say that's worth 10 out of 10. And there's the winner. Claude C. Kenny has won the first match of the first round. Let's give him a big round of applause. I wonder if Reyna was watching out there. I wonder where she is even. I won! How impressive! I saw the whole thing, Claude. Keep up the good work. Uh, was Reyna there? I couldn't tell you. I didn't see her anyway. Oh. We have a winner! Emma Bragovich has won the seventh match of round one! Show him some love, people! Oh, Diaz is on the slow boat to Loserville unless he shows up. I don't care anymore. Claude? Reyna! Congratulations! I heard from one of the soldiers. You made it past the first round. Reyna. I really wanted to watch, but I didn't realize you were the very first match. I would have stayed to watch if I had known. It's okay. Besides, you were angry at me. Oh! Diaz is up next! The eighth match of round one pits Thomas Nelson against Diaz Flack. Diaz was almost disqualified from the tournament, but he's got his weapon and he's ready for action. Let's see what they've got in store for us. Mere pawn. Ha! Air slash. Crescent cross. Air slash. And there he goes! 
Diaz Fleck has won the eighth match of round one. Let's give him a round of applause. Oh, he made it just in time. Um, so Reyna, what happened with Diaz? It was nothing serious. Some guy stole Diaz's weapon to keep him from entering the tournament, that's all. I'll let you off the hook for now, but you better believe we'll be wanting to hear more from you later. That's fine with you, right, Claude? Huh? Uh, what's this about? Pardon me, Mr. Kenny. Round two is about to get started, so could you return to the waiting room? Oh, sure. Good luck! Try not to lose! Claude, do your best, okay? I'll be watching. Got it! We're about to begin the second round, people. Good luck to all of you. Are you set to go? Are you set to go? Best of luck to you. Incredible! He's made it to the semifinals! Claude's absolutely the dreamiest! I can't believe what's happening! Wow! My heartbeat's going crazy here! The semifinals are about to get underway. Good luck, people. Are you set to go? Are you set to go? Best of luck to you. The semi-final round has finally arrived. What does fate hold for our competitors? Claude C. Kenny, our standout young contender, is matched against Grizzle's veteran, Woses Durahan. Let's see how it goes. Be careful. Air Slash! Air Slash! Double Slash! Well, I'd say that's worth 10 out of 10. It's only going to get hotter and hotter from here.
saw everything, Claude. You've really made it to the finals. I can barely believe it myself. Hey, you're the one that made it this far. Now you just gotta win the final. There's something I need to ask, though. Yes? Is Diaz still in it? The, the smoke, smoke has cleared. cleared. It's, it's time, time for the, the second, second semifinal, semifinal match. match. And, and what a match it is. Fate has brought, brought these two, two fighters, fighters against, against each other, other and, and fate, fate will allow only one of them to survive. Dias Black has dominated every match so far. Can Grand LaRoss put a stop to his mad rush? Here they come! Mere pawns. Crescent! Oh, crescent cross! He's still in it. He's been in control the entire tournament. You don't have to tell me, that's for sure. Even I can see how strong he is. What? Don't you want to win this? It's not that. Seeing how strong he is just makes me want to put everything I've got into this battle. Wow, Claude. That was totally cool how you said that. Sorry to bother you. Since the final match is about to begin, I'll need you to be over in the waiting room. Sure. Claude! How do you do it? You can do it! This is it. Have you got all your equipment sorted out? All set to go? All set to go? You've kept your side of the promise. Promise? Oh. Didn't Reyna tell you about it? Wait, what promise? <laughs> it's so amusing how irritated you get whenever Reyna's name comes up. This battle's for keeps, though. We're in the arena, Claude. I'm not gonna give you an inch. Expect the same from me. Claude, 
God. It's already over, Claude. It's over? So I... I... I'm sorry. You almost won, but he beat you at the very end. Oh, funny. I don't remember any of that. Dias! I don't think you're in any shape to talk like that to me, but I'll just ignore it for now. What do you want? I thought I'd come over to thank you. Thank me? You were better than I ever expected. I haven't had to put 100% into a fight in ages. Me? Don't get the wrong idea. It wasn't a compliment. Wh what You try not to spoil him either, Reyna. It'll be better for him if you keep him on a long leash. What are you talking about, Diaz? That's all I wanted to say. I need to get going. Dias! What? Will I see you again? Certainly, if the time comes. We should leave too. Are you sure? I'm still feeling a little lightheaded, but that's all. Must have been out for a while. Oh, that would be thanks to all the spells Reyna had cast on you. Really? Yeah. Thank you. Now then, why don't we take some of that energy and focus it on the Sorcery Globe investigation? The first thing to do is to go to Linga and get that book of ours deciphered. All right, Linga's our next stop then. Oh, but before we leave, we need to go claim your second place prize. Oh! There was a second place prize? I didn't know that. Claude? Claude. <laughs> Sorry.
let's make sure everything's squared away. First off, we're heading for Linga, right? Yep. We need to find someone who can read the ancient text for us. With some luck, it should give us some sort of clue behind the origin of the sorcery globe. Yeah, that too. The town's located more or less south of Lakur, if I recall correctly. Sounds good. Let's go. You all right? Uh, oh, I can't drink anymore. Man, he's wasted. I'd say I've won this round. Can I get an answer to my question now? You do remember that you promised to tell me whatever I wanted if I beat you in a drinking contest. What? What do you want? Does the name Ernest ring a bell? He's a man with three eyes, just like me. Uh, nope. I never seen or heard of him. Oop, oh, and he's out. So nothing again? Well, not that I was expecting very much. I might as well try asking you guys next. Have any of you seen a man with three eyes? Yeah, we have. Oh. Well, I knew that finding him wouldn't be easy from the start. Wait, you saw him? I'm pretty sure I did, yeah. When? Where did you see him? A little while ago, uh, near Cross Castle. So he's at Cross? Ah, oh, that's right. I should at least introduce myself. My name is Opera. Opera Vectra. I'm Claude. Claude C. Kenny. Well, thank you, Claude, but I need to get a move on to Cross. If we ever meet again, I'd love to talk some more.
We've come here today, Your Majesty, to consult with you regarding some important matters. Oh, and what would that be? Has a woman with three eyes visited you in the past? A woman with three eyes, indeed. I just concluded an audience with her, in fact. She came to ask me about a meeting I had with a three-eyed man several days prior. A man? Quite so. He had come seeking permission to enter the Mountain Palace. The Mountain Palace? Yes, it's the name we give to the cave by Lake Cole. It's been tended to by generations of castle stewards. You can find it north of the city. Opera can't be too far behind then. Indeed, I imagine she went to the Mountain Palace herself. Right after she heard my story, she asked for permission to enter. Um, would you be able to give us permission to enter as well? Oh, certainly. I must warn you, however, that you'll need to be careful. Monsters have taken up residence in the caves as of late. Thank you very much, Your Majesty. Not at all. I will inform the guard about you post-haste. A gift for the road. Thank you, Your Majesty. Guys, <laughs> that was easier than I thought. 